But hello once again, my Android friends. Welcome to another episode of The Mandroid Show. I am David, your Android junkie, over at androidspin.com. Is that what those are? Huh. Those letters? I thought they were just, you know, decorative IKEA stuff. But enough chit chat, let's talk some Android. Well, it looks like the AT&T HTC One X has a one-click root method. Well, that's not fair. Where's the One S one? Actually, there is one. Well, anyways, the One X method is brought to you by this guy, and he has seven simple steps for you to follow to get that bad boy rooted. But anyways, yes, fellow One S brothers, don't worry. I wrote up a nice little article showing you how to unlock your bootloader and get root on your phone. It's kind of one click too because once you get it unlocked, you just gotta download Superboot and do one simple command and BAM! That easy. I'm telling you, I had no problems at all, I promise. That only happened like five or twelve times. But anyways, my fellow HTC One brothers, check down the links below in the balls here for both of those methods. Get that bad boy unlocked, rooted, booted, and tooted, and get some of that carrier IQ off your phone. Did I say that? Asus has dropped a nice little promo video showing the pad phone in action. Yes, this 1.5 dual core beast is looking pretty snazzy, and cover your children's eyes because it has a little menage a trois with a tab and a keyboard dock. I don't know about you, but I got strangely turned on by this. So pretty exciting stuff, and you know, to be honest, I think this looks a little better than the Galaxy S3. Just my opinion, what do you guys think? Tell me down in the links below. The Asus Pad Phone, inspired by three ways, made by perverted developers. All right guys, it's time to dig up that old phone that you just cannot throw away. You know, your old Evo, your old G2. It's time to put a mod on it to turn your phone into just a regular old Wi-Fi enabled media player. Yes, this mod comes from Roots Wiki developer Jelly Bellies. I like that name. It's cute. And all you gotta do is flash this on the device and it removes everything about your phone that makes it a phone. And then as soon as it boots up, it turns off your cell signal and all you got is Wi-Fi, you can play your music, and your porno. So check down the links below for that if you have like an old device you'd just like to maybe have, maybe one of your kids use it as, you know, a MP3 player or whatever. I wonder if it would work on my old G1. Now it's time for Samsung Galaxy S3 Watch 2012! Battery test results of the Galaxy S3 have been shown to us and it's looking quite promising. Yeah, it looks like the 2100 milliamp powered battery is showing about 10 hours talk time and 10 hours video playback time. And now the web browsing was a little average, but it was nice to know that it was 25% better than its predecessor, the Galaxy S2. So that's good news for those of you that are looking to purchase the Galaxy S3. You know, main concerns for a new phone is how fast is it? what OS is on it, and of course, battery life. And it looks like the Galaxy S3 is holding up to par. The Samsung Galaxy S3, inspired by bad battery life, made by good battery life. Yeah. All right, nap of the week this week. This is for all my widget heads out there. I know there's some out there, and we should all like join up and create a cult. My mouth watered just thinking about it. <laughs> it really did. Got a little widget for you called Bling Board. Now what Bling Board is, it brings all your nice little social media together in one convenient little cute little widget. It's so cute. Seriously, this has become one of my favorite widgets. It's right smack dab in the middle of my home screen. Now what Bling Board does is it brings your missed calls, your messaging, your Gmail, your Facebook, and your Twitter all right there in that little widget box. Now once you download the app, you just log into your Gmail, your Facebook, your Twitter, pick your theme, there's five to choose from, and you can also pick your refresh intervals. And voila, you got a pretty little widget that shows a lot of stuff. I wish it was scrollable though, hopefully they integrate that, and hopefully they integrate the ICS Hollow thing, so we'll see what happens with that, but it's free in the Play Store, so what do you got to lose? Check it out, I really love it. Mandroid gives it five boners up. Okay, that was just... Disgusting. No, Mandroid approved. Thumbs up. No boners, weirdo. All right, tweak of the week this week. This is for my gingerbread and under brothers. Your guys' mouths are just begging for some of that ice cream sandwich, huh? What would you do for a Klondike bar? That's not the same. Well, I bring you Hollow Launcher. And what Hollow Launcher does is bring some ICS to your gingerbread and under device. Brings a lot of the features and customizations, and you don't even have to have ICS on your device. But if you do have ICS on your device, it'll still work with it. I actually tried it on my phone and, yeah, it ran pretty decent, but you know, Apex and Nova, you just can't 
can't go wrong. I've actually converted to Apex. Apex is as smooth as the back of my calves. Now you can't find this launcher in the Play Store, but check down the links below and hit the XDA thread and download that APK file. It's about as much ICS as you guys are gonna get. <laughs> crackheads. Well, all right, guys, that concludes Tuesday's show. I appreciate you clicking in. As always, make sure you subscribe to the Android Spin channel. Hit that like, thumbs up button. Show love with a like, like I always say. Leave a question down below if you want me to answer it on Friday's show. I'll do my best to do that. Also, give me some of them hot nerdy girl suggestions. Got one right back there. Yeah. Hmm. <sighs> hey, even if you have, like, pictures of, like, a girl just dressed up in nerdy, maybe I'll have, like, every other Friday just girls dressed in nerd. Huh? <laughs> what do you guys say? I don't like that idea. There's nothing hotter than some glasses, hair up, skirt, and okay, movement in the pants area. Make sure to check down links below for the website, the Twitter, the Facebook, and all the Google Plus. Add me to your circles, follow me on Twitter, like my Facebook, check out my other channel when I do vlogs and all that fun stuff. Didn't do a new one over the weekend, but maybe I'll do one this week. Well, all right, guys, I am David, your Android junkie over at AndroidSpin.com, and this has been the Mandroid Show. Alright, device updates. The HTC Evo 4G LTE. Shorten the name! Don't need all that. We'll be available for Sprint. Yeah, I'm gonna go inside and uh, uh, dunk a gallon of water in my head and uh, sit naked in front of the AC and wait for my, my